It's my birthday. I'm officially 28 years old. It doesn't feel like it. I literally feel like I'm still 22. <laughs> Definitely don't feel like I'm an adult now. Me and Bells, we're just chilling in bed. It's seven in the morning. Last night was a long night. So out of the last seven nights, I worked six. And then that first night, whenever I come off from work, I'm basically still in a night shift routine. Plus, I slept all day yesterday because I had worked the night before. And then Kaysen woke up at midnight last night. He was up probably till about 2.30 or so. It was a long night for us. And then, of course, I just, I fell asleep for about an hour and then I woke back up. And even though I'm tired and I would love to go to bed, I decided I'm going to go ahead and get up and get the day started. Start getting stuff ready because we have lots to do today. Me and Kaysen have some errands to run. We've got to get the house picked up a little bit. And then we're going to go and see monster trucks tonight. And then tomorrow, this is a flattering angle. Tomorrow, we're going to be going to the zoo. We're going to start getting ready for that. First thing, I've already had a shower. So, check that off my list. And then I need to clean out the trunk of my car because I have so much stuff. Does anyone else ever just pile stuff in their trunk? Like, just random stuff. Mainly it's stuff that I have to, like, donate that I really need to take to the Goodwill. Uh, but I think what's actually out there right now is some stuff that my sister gave me. Like, some clothes. Because her kids are a little bit older than Kaysen. So she gave me a bunch of the clothes. And then I need to wash those and get those out of my trunk. I have to get some... I let a friend borrow some baby stuff from whenever Kaysen was a baby. So I need to get that out and get that put it in storage. She's not supposed to be in the bed. And she knows better. So we're gonna start by cleaning out my car and hopefully I can get a lot of stuff done before Kaysen wakes up. But welcome to the vlog. It's gonna be a birthday vlog, weekend in my life. Not your typical weekend in my life because we have a lot of stuff to do. But I'm excited to see how Kaysen reacts. I feel like he's gonna do great. I feel like it's gonna be a good time. But I hope the noise doesn't freak him out any. And then of course the zoo. I always love going to zoos. And it's like a it's like a petting zoo kinda. Like you can pet kangaroos and stuff. And then they have this big fenced in yard. What are you doing? What are you doing? They have like this big fenced in yard where you can like actually go in with the animals like sheep and stuff like that. I think the last time I went it was maybe in 2016 or so so it's been a while but it's gonna be fun to take him. See it's not that bad. This is the baby stuff that I need to put in storage and then this is all the clothes that I'm just gonna toss in the washer and then this is just gonna stay in here Gonna get the wagon. Our storage building is so bad. So bad. We have a stroller. I got it from Amazon. But we much prefer the wagon. Ten times better. Wish we would have just done it from the beginning and put like his infant car seat in it or just laid him down flat in it. This is so much better. And it's cheaper. Like a hundred dollars cheaper. I'm really wanting to make some coffee, but I'm gonna wait until Casey wakes up. I'm gonna go to our local coffee shop and actually get something. I got a white chocolate pumpkin spice latte the other day. I think that's what it's called. And I got half the syrup for the white chocolate and it was so good and it's really what I'm craving today. So it's my birthday. 
So we're gonna treat myself and get one of those. But for right now, I think I'm just gonna make me some spearmint tea. made Kason some breakfast. He's got some avocado, some cubed cheese, some bacon, and then a fried egg that I just went ahead and cut up. It's nine o'clock and I'm struggling. I am struggling. I am so tired. Like my head's starting to hurt. I haven't had any caffeine and I'm sure that's a big part of it. So I think I'm about to have me some caffeine. It's going to be a long day. It's going to be long, especially if it's 9 a.m. and I'm already like wanting to go back to bed. I hate thirds sometimes, man. It is so hard. Like it's hard just to bounce back. I have some of this Mio energy and caffeine. You just mix it with water. I think I'm gonna have some of that. Hopefully it'll kinda help with my head a little bit. So I'll just get a little bit of water. You can't see it, whatever. Just about a cup of water in there and then Squirt it on in there. I love this flavor, the Acai Berry Storm. It's a really good flavor. Give it a good stir. While Kason is eating his breakfast, I'm gonna hook I'm gonna hook my phone up to my laptop and get rid of some of the pictures that are on my phone so that way I can vlog on my phone. Plus I know I'm gonna take a ton of pictures today and tomorrow. I've had this laptop since 2012 and it's the one that I store all of my pictures on. That's my phone. That's the storage on my phone. So we're going to have to fix it. And I would say 99% of that is pictures. Why don't you try your avocado? Do you like your eggs? Try it. Eggs, bacon. He already tried a piece of cheese and spit it out, which is weird because he usually eats cheese. I already know he's not gonna eat the avocado, but I at least want it to be there for an option if he wants it. He'll eat his eggs and he'll eat his bacon. You no. to try your avocado. Huh? Hey. Where's the cheese? Where is it? Huh? Where's the cheese? Mm. Where's the avocado? Ick. Yeah, take a bite. Ick. I'm struggling. Ick. 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 I'm being told to sit. What do you want me to do? Ick. What do you want? You want me to sit? Uh -oh. <laughs> I'm trying to get his diaper bag ready, but we're at this really weird part in the year where it's really cold in the morning, then it gets hot during the day, and then it's really cold at night. And I just don't know what to pack. And at the monster truck thing, they have like this fun zone. They have this fun zone where the kids can go in. It's basically like this little mud dirt pile and they can take like excavators and stuff and like play in the dirt and then they have a bounce house. And of course it's gonna be dirty at the track whenever we're walking and everything. And I'm sure, I have no doubt that he's gonna end up throwing a fit at some point and throwing himself down on the ground and whatever. I need to take extra clothes, but I don't know what to pack. Plus the dry stuff in the dryer still has 20 minutes left on it. So this is what I've got going so far. <laughs> I've got choices. I'm definitely going to take a pair of pants, probably a couple stretchy pants. I want him to wear his boots because it'll look cute, but honestly, the shoes are probably going to be more comfortable. And then I also want to go ahead and start getting stuff ready for tomorrow. That way, that's one last thing that I have to do. Tonight, it starts at 5, 
like you can get there at five and you can do the monster trucks in the fun zone and whatever the actual show doesn't start until seven he normally gets a bath at seven and is in bed i'm expecting him to be a little overtired we might be pulling another overnighter tomorrow the zoo opens up at nine and i would like to get there as soon as they open or at least by like 9 30 10 but today he didn't get up until nine. It's so hard to plan. It's so hard to plan whenever you have children. A child, I have one and I'm struggling. What are you doing, you silly kid? What are, what are you doing? What are you doing? He is in such a good mood today. Can you see yourself? Oh, there's one here. Hey, say I too. Kill. Say I too. I don't trust you. <laughs> I don't trust you at all. Are you eating bacon? Hmm? Are you eating bacon? <laughs> bacon, yeah. I tried to get him to try a piece of the avocado. I even put it on his fork and he took it and like, he smeared my camera. Oh my God. <laughs> Big grease stain on it. Up. Bye. Button, yeah. Bye. 70 degrees outside right now. By three o'clock, it's gonna be 80. We're gonna leave here at four, it'll still be 80. So it's like he needs to go in shorts and then we're gonna have to change him in pants once he's there. But I guess that kind of works out because he's gonna get dirty in that little fun zone anyway. Oh no. What are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> You're silly. You're being a cheeky kid. I can't handle the cuteness. You look adorable. <laughs> He's got his boots on. He's got boots on like dad. He has on his Paw Patrol socks. He has on rubble. He looks like such a little man. Right there, right there. I have to show you these pants that I got from Walmart. They were $21, I think, 22. It's been so long since I've bought something other than skinny jeans. But I seen this TikTok and it was talking about pants, whatever, and I was like, okay, I'll give them a try. Cause the last time I wore pants like this was probably back in high school. But I got these at Walmart, they're the Lee brand. I got a size eight. I feel like they're a little snug for a size eight, but at the same time, I wear my pants so loose that like maybe that's how they're supposed to fit. But they're just like normal, normal jeans. And honestly, I like them. Like they're really comfortable. They're just casual. I feel like I could dress them up if I wanted. They are mid-rise boot cut. Yeah, mid-rise boot cut. And I like them, they're cute. I also got, I got me some new earrings. I finally got my second hole done. So now I can start wearing two. I really wanna get my third hole done. And then I also wanna get right here done. But I thought that was cute. For Kaysen, this is the outfit that he wore today. His Johnny Cash shirt with some jeans and boots. It's warm outside, but I don't think it's hot enough to wear. Jeans will be uncomfortable, but we do have shorts just in case. I'm bringing him an extra pair of tennis shoes in case he gets tired of walking in his boots or his boots just get really dirty. I've got all of his extra clothes. I've got some short sleeves, some long sleeve stuff. I got him a hoodie in case if it gets really cold. And then we went and got these. These are earmuffs. 
We paid $13 for them. We tried them on him and they fit, but he was not too happy about having them on. So we'll see if that was actually worth our money or not. They had more that were like $25-ish dollars and then they had, they had a youth set that was 40, but I was like, for him probably to not even wear them, we're only gonna spend 13. It was the cheapest ones that we could find. I also went ahead and restocked on my CoverGirl eyebrow pencil. I get the shade Soft Blonde. The one that I have on today is actually, I think it's like light brown, and I think it's a little too dark, so I went ahead and just got the Soft Blonde because that matches me better. I still have not had a coffee, so we're actually gonna leave earlier. The coffee place is open until five, so we're gonna leave a little bit earlier so that way I can finally stop and get my white chocolate pumpkin spice latte. I need to finish getting case and ready, but that won't take me but just a minute. Everything's already out in the truck. Dylan just went to go clean out the truck and fill it up. It's 2.13 and it starts at five. It takes us about an hour to get there. Plus I wanna stop and get coffee first. So we're right on time. I feel like I need to address the elephant in the room, which is my hair because the last vlog that I uploaded, it was Platinum Blonde. If you're new or you haven't watched that, my hair used to be very, very bright blonde. It was basically platinum. Maybe not like completely platinum, but it was it was really, really bright. And I had the spontaneous idea to dye my hair strawberry red. I actually went to the salon and had it done, and it turned out so good, and I loved it, and I thought it matched my skin tone perfect. But whenever we did it, so that way, in case I regretted the decision and I could get my blonde back, we ended up just using a toner, except at the root. I don't know if she just used a darker toner or if it was more like a permanent or demi-permanent. I don't know what she used at my root. But after the first time that I washed my hair, pretty much the toner just washed out and the root part stayed, but it turned into like this orangey red color and it just, it wasn't very cute. And I had messaged her about it and everything, and it was no fault to her own. We knew that it was going to wash out really quick. I just wasn't expecting it to be like the first wash. So she can't get me in until the end of October, and this was at the beginning of October whenever I had it done. So I ended up just going, I ended up doing a lot of Googling because I had these really bright red, orangey roots, and the rest of it was kind of like this. It was pretty much like this, maybe just a little bit lighter. And it said to use dark ash blonde or medium ash blonde, anything ash to cancel out the orange. So I went to Walmart and I got Boxa. It was dark ash blonde and it pretty much made it, it made it look better. Is it great? No. Do I miss my blonde? Yes. Do I regret going strawberry blonde? Kinda. Did I learn my lesson? Absolutely not. I'd probably still do it again one day, but I digress. I'm going Wednesday to get my hair touched up and I'm gonna go back blonde. I don't hate, I don't hate the dirty blonde. This is like my natural color. This is, maybe with a little bit more of a red tint and I don't hate it, but I do miss my blonde. So I'm just, I'm just vibing with the dirty blonde for right now. Blonde Kelly will be back soon. <laughs> Hey, are you excited to go see monster trucks? I bought him some Paw Patrol socks and it has rubble on it and he loves them. You like your rubble socks? Who is that? Who is that? Is that Rocky? Who is it? Who is that? Rocky? Yeah. Come on. I need some of that whipped topping on. White pumpkin latte with half the white chocolate syrup. It's 
It's really good. Do you want to try it? No, I'm good. I don't like anything that has pumpkin in it. We're going to see the monster trucks. We're we'll gonna ride a monster truck today. We're excited. What about you, Kay? Turn my iPad back on, Mom. <laughs> Big truck! Big truck! <laughs> yeah! We're gonna go ride big trucks. What is it? Can you say hi, bird? Apple. All right, let's go this way. We got him just sitting there. Turn your flash on. Push it. Come on, Bubba. Come on, Bubba. Come on over here. 
here and see. Gentle casing. Casing. Leave it alone. I stepped in poop. Emu poo. Oh, I just felt food. <laughs> I stepped in kangaroo piss. <laughs> he said, y'all eat that? <laughs> Don't let them have that plastic. Yeah, we'll have it. Hey. Oh, the little one. Okay. Oh my God, the tortoise. Tortoise fights. <laughs> the crocky tortoise. Look, she's breaking them up. Really heavy. Oh. Casey, come sit on this thing. <laughs> uh oh, this other one's coming now. So that's what they just turn into their I guess in the wild, that just kills them. If you can pick that one up and carry them all the way over that field. <laughs> I know it's massive. He's stepping on his foot. He's scratching his balls. It's a pig, yeah. It's a big old pig. It's a big old pig. It's a big old pig. Don't go away. <laughs> that thing will that bite you. That was okay, you. wasn't it? Yeah, no, you're good. You're good. You're good. You're good. Okay. You're good. You're good. <laughs> it scared oh, me. <laughs> 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 Even if they pinch you, it just feels like that. What is it? They won't actually. Yeah, he does pinch you. Yeah. What is it? He just did that. Do you have some hey, food? Hey, hey. Oh, okay. Okay. Do you have any food? Do you have any food? Do you have any food? Go get it. Get it! It's gonna get you! Here. 
You like that big bad oh. was chasing you down. You're, you're different. He likes her, see? Easy, easy. Now oh, you're walking away. What do you do this one? What is it, Kason? What is it, Coda? Yeah. Here, go pet it. This thing's making more for me to make. You say you don't like it? Oh, you better pick Kason. <laughs> done it. I done this before you fall. I won't cut you don't know I'm stolen.